There is now fury over Wonder Woman, uh, the, mo the upcoming movie, and the fury from the social justice left over the fact that Wonder Woman is promoting protein bars. <laughs> <laughs> the slogan is Think Thin. Because yeah. we couldn't have a superhero being super. I mean, first off, this is a superhero. No one expects these superheroes to be, you know, a representation of the average person. They're superheroes. Sure. They have superpowers. <laughs> and so it's, it's, it's a tale as old as time, first off, that when you have people who are in great shape or people who are attractive, they advertise products for fitness and beauty because people want to buy those products. And feminists complain all the time about how they don't, well, who's, where's our hero? They don't have enough strong female characters. Well, here you have this woman who plays Wonder Woman. They want this, these strong, we don't have enough strong female characters for ourselves. First off, the reason you don't is because women tend to get their ass kicked in real life. Ronda sure. Rousey get her ass kicked by an average middleweight at a local smoker fight. Let's just be realistic <laughs> about that. True. But when you go into the realm of superpowers, fine, we'll give it to you. Now they have a strong ass kicking female. This is actually an Israeli woman who served yeah. in the Israeli Defense Forces. <laughs> She's one of too. the most badass militaries <laughs> out there. A strong, uh, vocal, uh, I guess you'd say classical feminist who actually kicked people's asses. And they're upset because it's not a fat, blue haired, feminist, whiny amoeba. <laughs> who supports Hamas. <laughs> it's never enough. That's not very intimidating. It's You're never right. enough yeah. for them. Can we have, can we have, like, can we have, like, a fat Palestinian superhero maybe? <laughs> can you, like, maybe put, like, any humor, like, that would be really, <laughs> really refreshing. They want to encourage people to have good health, healthy self-esteem. She says with the MTV Awards, trans, self-esteem. You should be happy. We want to encourage healthy self-esteem so that you're happier. Well, okay, let's talk about health and self-esteem. Obesity rate in the United States for women is rising from 38% to 41% in 10 years. We know the health risks associated with obesity. We've talked about this many times. 80% uh, risk of type 2 diabetes, cancers. It is unhealthy. It's bad for your joints. People won't have sex with you. There are a multitude of reasons <laughs> as to why you don't want to be overweight. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna get letters. Yes, it's I just you're, they're taking a super. They're taking a beautiful superhero who has a great story to tell as a strong woman, and it's not enough. And this is why there, sh there should be no compromise with the no. anti-free speech totalitarian left. Because when you put forward someone like this, and you go, you know what? This is a woman, great, strong, Israeli defense. No, because why? She sold a protein bar. Okay, that's <laughs> enough. And it, it was enough of a, of a enough. backlash. Enough. This is true. This was at Gizmodo. It was enough of a backlash. They created this campaign. Everyone can be, we are all Wonder Woman. <laughs> I love, first off, I love, hold on, hold, hold, keep that up. I love how the biggest, first off, it's racist because the tallest one is black. <laughs> what are you saying? She's some Amazonian? Yeah. And then Tribal I love lady. The Wonder Woman in the wheelchair. <laughs> no, the wheelchair can't be Wonder Woman because Wonder Woman has superpowers. This is true. She, ha she doesn't get in. They have healing abilities. <laughs> it doesn't work. They totally missed the point. It'd be like Wolverine. It's like, I have, I have mutant healing abilities. Also, zoom out, I have rickets. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> all, of a, all of a sudden, Superman is like Doc Holliday. He has to move out west because of his tuberculosis. <laughs> 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 These are superheroes. <laughs> We're all Wonder Woman. I thought this was self-explanatory. <laughs> they've just, they've gone so far. And by the way, I'm so happy they're doing this because there's, there's going to be backlash. Oh, absolutely. The genderless MTV awards, the Rolling Stone comedian keep list, pushing. which we'll talk Please, about. Keep and now the Wonder, we don't have Wonder Woman in a wheelchair and protein bars. It's just... Please continue, and we wanted to put it to the test. Uh, if can we all be Wonder? I think we are all Wonder Women. I absolutely believe that. So, Aaron the intern, come on out here. Aaron the in Aaron the intern. We Aaron the intern needs to come out here because on, we Aaron wanted to put this. Uh -oh. Aaron the intern. There he is. There, there he is. Come on. <laughs> come on. <laughs> come on. We can all be Keep Wonder Woman. It. That's there we go. right, baby. <laughs> oh, that is that is. Uh, Testicle retractingly <laughs> scary. Aaron the intern. Aaron the intern, do you um do you feel wonderful? Thank you, Steven. Well, I pretty much figured that's not nice to say to your boss. <laughs> Seriously though, I mean this this is about empowerment. We see this we're empowering women. Do you I love feel it. do you I feel love empowered? It. No. You don't feel empowered? Do you no. feel wonderful? Do you do you feel as though you're you're more like you're representing the unheard voice out there? You guys can go to hell. <laughs> <laughs> it's about empowerment. You know what I think? I think the reason that uh, Wonder Woman doesn't feel wonderful enough yet is because 
what's one without her without her invisible jet? Ooh. Why don't you take Why don't you take a ride in your invisible jet? Oh, Come on, you're yeah. in the intern. Why don't you take you a would. ride in your invisible jet? You said jet. you would. <laughs> it's It's the wonderful the thing. Floor is yours. Take the ride in your invisible jet. Maybe, it's, Maybe it's, he needs some music. Maybe, some Maybe he needs some music to cue him. There. <laughs> All right. No, hold on. So you need to open the door. You get the invisible jet. Open the door to get in the invisible jet, Aaron the intern. <laughs> okay. Now you get in the jet. There you go. There you go. You got it. This isn't. This is empowering. Come on. <laughs> I'm inspired. Well, hold on a second. Can you shift the jet closer to my table? Because you're kind of... <laughs> <laughs> it's empowering. We want to empower people. Get, squat like you're really in a jet. Come no on. one sits like that in, a, in an invisible jet. Don't half. Don't half-ass this, Wonder Woman. <laughs> okay, there you go. There you go. Ride that. How, how fast are you going? Boom. Wonder Woman. F*** you guys. <laughs> Aaron the intern. I quit. He has no appreciation uh, for the wonder and splendor that is women. Hey, this video was taken as a clip from the full show, Daily Show at LotterWithCredit.com slash MugClub, where it's available exclusively $69 a year. That's less than $6 a month, less than two expensive cups of coffee, or you can feed an African child. But what would you want to do? Just buy coffee or join the Mug Club. Daily Show, LotterWithCredit.com slash MugClub. See you there. Don't feed children.